probably not the best way to start off a vlog. Maybe. <laughs> I wanted to do a natural hair update and I figured if I don't do it now, it won't get done. <laughs> so I'm going to do it while I'm getting ready. And I hope that's okay with you guys. I gather a few questions that I got on my Big Chop video and put them together with what I thought I would want to know before I cut my hair and owie um I'm gonna see if I can answer those for you but well, I transitioned for two years and I used mostly protective styling so that was like braids extensions um crochet braids all that good stuff. I really didn't wear my hair out during that time period, which was probably really unhealthy. But two years, uh, 20 months, 20 months. Probably really weird angle. Uh. <laughs> I did my big chop last December, so that was 2000. <laughs> and it being January now, I am late, but it has been officially a year um, that I've been natural. And I've been quite enjoying it, by the way. Should not have waited so long. So if you're thinking about transitioning, I really think just do it. I believe it was a 4C, um, but one thing that I didn't learn until later on is that your hair's not necessarily, or for me, my hair's not the same texture all around my head. So I noticed that my curls are looser in some areas, like the nape, um, the whole back back area of my head, and quite uh, kinky at the top. Um, but yeah, I actually filmed some clips after I washed my hair, and I will insert them so you can see what I'm talking about. That was a huge thing when I was big chopping, is that I wanted somebody to tell me what was my hair going to look like? Yes, you can watch all the videos that you want, do all the research that you want, but the only way that you're going to know what your texture is going to be is when you actually let it go natural and then cut the black part off. Sorry. Bye. Love ya. Okay. So, what's the next question? I'm really bad at this. My go-to hairstyles are the mini twist, which is what I'm wearing now. Also, untwist the mini twist, which is also a style. And I do, uh, what is this called? A twist out. And from a twist out, I go to a puff. So I pretty have much have like four go-to hairstyles. Um, mini twists are my favorite, although they take forever. Um, I end up being able to wash my hair in the twist and being able to rock it for a really long time. Not going to be looking at the camera at all. I hope that's okay. Maybe. Oh, shoot. I uh, forgot to do the lens check, so <laughs> this comes back down. I have done a small trim that was in March. I haven't done one. I haven't even looked at the old video to see how far I've come, but this is the length of the front sides. So I guess the only thing that's bad about filming and getting ready is that I'm not doing anything proper. <laughs> My nails look like crap, and I keep forgetting where I left off with the questions, and my card is almost full, so... My go-to hair products was the next question, I believe. For my leave-in, I used the Mayans Hail Conditioner. I used it as a deep conditioner, and I used it as a leave-in, and um, I actually didn't know I could do that until I read the back of the bottle. The things we learn when we read. My favorite product of all is shea butter and because I use shea butter I notice, which is another question, 
that I have to wash my hair more frequently. So I wash my hair a minimum, at least weekly. And if I've had a hard workout, then I'll wash it after that too. Um, that way I find, or I found that I got more breakage when I didn't moisturize my hair. And the best moisturizer for your hair is water. So I wash my hair quite frequently. If I'm not using shea butter, then I don't use shampoo. I just um, co-wash it with the main, main and tail, main and tail. Uh, my nails hold on how often do I straighten my hair and within the last year I've only straightened it twice and both were a fail for me I couldn't get it as straight as I wanted to and even in the texture that I had it um, I noticed it was too flat for me I've gotten way too used to big hair big curls and uh, straight hair is just not it for me right now maybe later on it will be for right now I don't enjoy how it looks straightened so um blown out is different though blown out I, I enjoy so ugh, smart right <laughs> i think that's pretty much it i think i pretty much covered everything if there's any questions that you guys have um feel free to leave them below i will either answer them in the comment section or i'll come back with a video um, depending on how my nails look terrible on how uh, large the answer will be how large the answer will be how in depth i have to go with the answer yeah so that's pretty much it um thank you guys for watching and please subscribe if you would like to and i will see you guys at some point later i will not say soon because i don't know how this is going to go but yeah thanks for watching bye